Hello everyone and welcome to a new Let's Play. We are going to play Duskers. Duskers is an indie strategy game that puts you into a role of a captain of a vessel stranded in the space, surrounded by derelict vessels that you are trying to salvage. The game is in early access, so the content is not all there yet, but it's already kind of fun and I thought it might be worth my time and your time to look at it. So without further ado, let's do that. We are going to play a new game. Okay, here we are in the actual game. You can see us as this blue triangle and there are four ships next to us. Uh, there's one ship at our location currently, then there's number two, number three, and number four. I guess there are two and two and four, but this is uh, the amount of fuel that will take us to get to them. And if there is something I know about this ship, we don't have a lot of fuel. We got six propulsion, which means we can only jump, for example, here and then here, but not further than that. Now, we will salvage these vessels that are nearby by using our drones. We don't have that many of them. We got only three at this point. Uh, we got Zack, Aaron, and Robbie. We could rename them, but I kind of like these names. You know, they make it super cute. So we're going to keep them. Zack has a motion detector and is a gatherer. Aaron is a generator drone. And Robbie can tow an interface with stuff, which is important, you will see in about a second. So let's board the first vessel. We are going to use all of our three drones in the boarding sequence. And yeah, let's do it. Okay, this is a report of uh, the vessel that we have just approached. Uh, scanning is inconclusive. Infestation types detect zero. How integrity is good. Uh, direct info, row 2. Oh, name, row v2. Class, directive intelligence. We have no information about its class, it seems. Crew is 4, hold is 9. Government employees. There are some logs, but all of them are corrupted. How nice. So here we are uh, in the actual game. Let me just uh, get to the main view. This is how the game looks and this is the strategy map. You can see that there is one room here and then there's another room here. All of our three drones are located here. And there's probably another room here and one here. These A1, D3 and D5 uh, means airlock 1, door number 3, door number 5. So there's somewhere door number 1, 2 and 4 and probably even six, who knows. Uh, this is our ship. We have uh, boarded the vessel through this airlock and we are now going to get in there. So let's open airlock one and select Zach, who is going to go inside. So we found a scrap. Uh, Zach is a gatherer, so we can gather this scrap. It's going to be useful later on. And there's a power inlet here. So Aaron is a generator drone, so he can come here in this area and interface with the generator, thus giving the derelict ship a power source. Okay, we now see the rest of the ship. There are five rooms. Uh, well, actually, there's room number two, three, four, and five. I don't see room... Well, actually, the airwalk seems to be room number one. So that's room one, two, three, four, and five. There's the door number two, and door number one is probably the airlock. So, let's uh, switch to Zack again. He has something called a motion detector, which is uh, fairly important. As door number four is open, I kind of see no point in uh, doing a motion detector sweep here, because we would be already dead. But just to show you how it works, I'm going to do the motion detector here. And you can see that all of these three rooms are clear. So let's open door number two and put Zach inside. Okay, we found some scrap here. So let's gather the scrap and gather the other scrap. And see, there's a fuel access point. Nice. We're gonna get some fuel. Zero days proportion acquired. Zero jump cells acquired. Okay, so there was nothing in there. 
Great. So let's see door number five. I'm gonna do the motion detector as well. I know that on the first ship you never encounter enemies, but later on they are everywhere. So there's some scrap here. Let's gather all. Zack is gonna take care of that. And we also had that derelict drone here. I'm not sure if I uh, told you, but you probably saw it on the screen. Let's check it out. Uh, the drone is called the Jeremy. It's destroyed. Can we get something from it? Oh, it has a stun ability. I never saw that one before. Hmm. As I said, I don't have really that much experience with this game, so it's kind of cool to see all the new stuff. Is there anything else in here that we might be interested in? No, we already saw this other room. Yeah, there is nothing. So, uh, motion all A1. Wait, no, no, no. It's. Uh, move? No, what's the. Haha. -ha. There was a command for. Close exit help. You know, navigate. Okay, so. Navigate all A1. We'll put all of your drones. Navigate drone. Oh, there has to be two. Call to a one. Hmm. Navigate drone all a one. Okay, that doesn't seem to work either. I don't know why. There was a command for navigate all, but navigate uh, drone three a one should work. Yeah. So you can use these commands to move your drones automatically. There was uh, also a command to navigate all of them. I um, kind of forgot what it was. Huh, interesting. Anyway, we can now close A1. We scavenged off this ship and we can now uh, exit. So let's see what we gained. We got six scrap. Uh, inventory change readout. Yes, stun upgrade added to drone Zack. End of summary. Okay, so we can now access the modification screen where we can, for example, increase speed of our drones or increase max HP or convert drones into scrap, which is not something I really like to. You can also upgrade each of their abilities. For example, the motion detector could be upgraded to add 25 more motion sensors. Or we could uh, upgrade a stun. Add to stun mines. I can't do that for some reason. Not sure why. Drone generator two. Is it maybe because he doesn't have that? Oh, oh I think I know what the problem is. Nope, I don't know. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Let's uh, just not do that anyway, because we will use the scrap later on to upgrade some of the more important stuff. Now we can go either here to Triumph 2 or Kamchatka 2. Kamchatka 2 seems reasonable, so let's travel there. And we will board this new ship as well. It's gonna be a bit harder to board this one, I'm pretty sure. It's Salvage C Class, it's 15 years old. Infestation type 1. Yes, we got enemies here. How integrity is good, so we can now board the ship. Okay, the scan report says uh, that it's inconclusive. Infestation types detected 1. Good hull integrity. Kamchatka 2. It's a prisoner transport. Ha! Huh. It was supposed to be scavenge class. Or was that us? Oh, I'm not sure. Crew 4. We had 17 prisoners in there. Hmm, there are some logs in here as well, but yeah. So you can see this room, uh, number two, on up here, there's door three, door four, door five here, and a one. Now, because there are enemies here, I'm gonna start by using the motion sensor right from the beginning, because I don't want to get killed. Oh, a one. Okay, there's... Oh, D10. Close, close, close. Oh, I cannot close it. Okay, power inlet. Come on, quick, 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 quick. Okay, 
D10 floats. Okay, now I'm not kidding about the enemies. If they get close to us, they will destroy our drones. Yeah, and there is one up there in room number five. It's kind of a bummer. That's the room I wanted to go to. Hmm. Okay, let's open this door that I closed a minute ago and see if there's anything in here. We get some scrap and another generator here. So let's uh, gather all. And we might want to move our generator drone in here. Because it will give us a better view of the room. So navigate uh, drone to R4. So while well, our drone is coming here, we can think about what we're gonna do. I have uh, an idea of what we could do here, but let me just see if we can see some other rooms. Yeah, there's another airlock over there. We could basically also uh, take our drones, uh, close this door, let the enemy go in here, and then let our ship dock at A2. That's actually a pretty good idea, I think. We're gonna do that. Robbie here. Agrees. Okay, I forgot to navigate the drone the one. Where's this room? Forgot our And Robbie's gonna go here. Well, we are going to gather all here. Okay, we acquired the scrap that was here. I'm gonna close the airlock. And I'm also going to close this door. I'm going to turn on the motion sensor. And I'm gonna open... Oh, I can't! The door is not powered. Oh, this sucks. Okay, well that uh, puts a dent in my plan, so let's go to the next room, D6, and see if we can find anything interesting here. Uh, what is this? It's, uh... Okay, we got some more scrap. Awesome. Okay, we're not going to open this door. What is this? More scrap. More scrap. Right, right. And is the D5 closed? Yes, it is. So let's open D3. There's a fuel axis point here. Let's gather. Oh, nice! We gathered one day worth of propulsion. Uh, gather all of this. And I'm gonna use Dock A2. Does that work? It should. Yep, it did. Awesome. So what we could do now is oh we can't oh, god damn it that sucks hmm i want to get into the room number five there could be something interesting in here let me try to get robbie in here and oh wait wait generator we need to open door number 10 And now if I use this generator... Does it... Yeah, it actually does. Okay, but then we cannot... Okay, I see what we have to do now. Okay, my original plan was just stupid. There's <laughs> no much... Nothing else that I can say about that. Not much else to mention. So, navigate, uh, drone, free, what's the room, air free, and we're going to close the door number six, and once he goes through that, yep, we are going to go to the other generator, close D10, and we are going to open D8. Motion. Soon the enemy will move to D 
uh, through D8 to room number four. Okay, now we can close the door and open door number five. And we should be safe here. Yep, he's locked in there. So let's see, this drone is... Is it... Is it damaged or destroyed? Brandon. Oh no, it's not destroyed. We can uh, tow it. Okay, let's open D1. Uh, dock A1. Tow. Come on, A1. Okay, and navigate drone all A1. Nope, it's not working, I don't know why. Navigate uh, drone 1 A1. Oh wait, it's uh, room 1. Let me see, navigate drone 1 room 1. And our is gonna grow. Why so? So yeah, we can now close A1 and exit. And we got a new drone. Loading statistics. Uh, propulsion fuel collecting one. We got 10 scrap. We survived three days. And we found Brendan, who has a trap ability, obviously. Not sure. Okay, let's see about the drone configuration. We got Brendan here. Who has a trap? Drops an explosive trap. Oh, this is interesting. I never had this one before. Hmm. I'm gonna keep Brendan though in storage and we are going to put the trap on on Robbie. So we now have two drones that are fully equipped, and we have Aaron who is a generator drone. Now, uh, let's check the ship configuration. There isn't anything here at this point, so we can't do anything there. And can we upgrade uh, these abilities? How did you? Okay, it's in under M like modifications. So Zach has. Hmm. We can increase the speed by 35%, which might be worth our while because we are using him a lot. So let's do that. And we could upgrade the motion sensor. Let's do that as well. It's our most useful drone. Increasing the HP doesn't seem like a good idea, though. Robbie. What does Robbie have? Is he have a trap? Or is it Aaron? <laughs> Not sure. I'm gonna keep the rest of the scrap and I'm going to increase uh, the speed of Robbie as well. And we could fix Brandon for one. Okay, let's do that. So we have an extra drone in case uh, she hits the fan. Oh, it only repairs a bit of HP. Uh, you know what, let's, uh, let's repair him. He's gonna be good, he has 110 HP, so eventually we will start using him because we don't need to invest into him that much. Hmm. Now how much uh, proportion we have? Four. So we can get here and then here safely, not a problem. So let's go and board this ship so yeah this is us uh, no 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 it's uh yeah it's the ship ship class bar c i i don't really know why why it's showing the names here and not there it's probably a bug infestation type one how integrity good it's 19 years old we are going to put uh these three drones there as usual and we are going to board the ship right now